Hello there everyone and welcome back to Red World, a mod that from my understanding is still being worked on at the time of this recording, but of course I'm your host Mr. Mocha Lover, but let's see, where are we? Last time we might have lost a division in Libya, in the deserts of Libya claim another victim, whatever, led by Hama Hamamamai. Well, kind of nice name, HH, cool. But, okay, let's talk about some comments here first. I did say I want to do reverse the movement, but there's actually a bunch of support for us to actually stay communist instead of becoming a Tsar, you know, of Russia or the Soviet Union, because apparently a lot of other people have already done that. And I don't always want to do everything the same, as much as I would absolutely love crowning Putin as Tsar, there's actually a, even a lot more support for us to stay communist, so we'll probably just maintain the path and see what happens. Chairman Putin shall bring communism to its rightful place in the world, and the final ideology to ever exist, because communism apparently always works, because if it didn't work, if communism fails every time, well then, then why did we win the Cold War? Hello? Yeah? We have other comments to go through as well. But yeah, with Red World, from my understanding, from your comments, and actually trying to look into it a little more, even though, you know, the unfortunate past name Kaiser, 1871, it's still being worked on to what he originally wanted, so we'll see more and more, hopefully, of this mod on this channel, which, which should be a lot of fun. It should be a lot of fun. Obviously, I don't know everything about this mod, and you guys are going to help me along, hopefully. And we'll learn more and more, and we'll try to do better. Modern hardware will be nice. Let's grab some other things here. So, I'm not really sure what to expect. Let's grab some artillery. Since this is on historical, reminder about this is on historical. Hi, this is State Transfer Tool Mod, because we don't need it right now. And, let's see, drones, we love drones, god, ah, oh, drones, oh, what happened to Northern Ireland, Ulster, why are they independent, oh, Bastion of European Democracy, alright, we got some 2010 heavy ships, you know what, let's go for super heavy battleships, because I actually don't usually make those, that sounds like a lot of fun, uh, I love upgrading ships, this is one of my favorite things, I know a lot of other people don't like this, but man, I, it's, it's fun, like, Putting on some of the best equipment, best slots for your ships, and then just watch, watching them just decimate enemies. Oh, just it's such a good feeling. You click, you click, and you click, and you make a pretty good ship. Very good. Cool. And actually, did I upgrade these guys yet? Carriers looking... Oh my goodness, I did not. Oh, that is a mistake, I will say. Actually, get rid of that. We're going to have screens... Get some armor. I always like putting a little bit of armor on there. Good. Go and do that too. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Oh, good, 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 good. Light cruisers. Oh, why? Why did I not edit this yet? Oh my goodness. What is wrong with me? Oh, uh, let's see. Torpedo launchers. I kind of don't mind that. Instead of this, we're actually going to grab some anti-sub stuff. I, it's always worthwhile grabbing a little bit of anti-submarine tactics or, you know, attachments. Just because... Ooh, the enemy can have lots of subs. And I don't like enemy subs. I want to blow all them sub submarinos up. And enemy and our subs actually need to upgrade as well, probably. Oh, God. Good Lord. Garbage. Trash. Oh, no. No, it's okay. That's okay. It's not great. It's still not great. Don't get me wrong. But that's okay. There we go. Cool. Uh, what do we have? It's just all ship stuff. Yes, it is. Actually, one, two, three. Yes, very nice. Uh, someone did recommend we just keep focusing more on tanks and tanks and tanks and motorized because they're so much better than infantry. Which is completely true, by the way. Yeah, other stuff, not super great. But, let's see. I would like to go to Yoslavia. So, I, I'm not sure what's going to happen after we do this. We have a stagnating economy, which isn't good. So, after we maintain the path... Actually, let's look at research. Yeah, we've got plenty of time. After maintaining the path, I really don't want to do this. Cooperate with nationalists. I don't want stuff to not be a core of us, so... We're going to solidify our group over Europe. In the past few years, it's become evident that even some of our allies in Europe are beginning to see faults in the Soviet world order and drifting away. This cannot be allowed to happen, so everyone's going to become slightly more communist. Boris. Not bad, natural order. Pavel. Ah, uh, let's go with Boris. Good old Boris here, eh? Electronics. We're going with industrial concerns, because I believe there's probably more that we can do for that than anything else in terms of, like, versus electronics versus industry, so that'd be nice. And what are the world conflicts that are happening? Can I, you know, do we want to support Syria? Russia supporting Syria? Or Lebanon? Well, actually, what do you have for national spirits there? Corporate cooperation. Corrective movement. Damascus. Oligarchs. I don't really care for oligarchs, to be honest. Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, yeah. We are the leader of a faction. So, counterintelligence. Yelena? Why not? Oh, why not, Yelena? Beautiful at Yelena. And another truck. Maintain the path. Very cool. Put you guys over here. They're very nice. And just solidify our group over Europe because we need to. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, we got a good amount of armor cards. That's pretty nice. Uh, what wars are going on? I want to get involved. I want things to go kaboom. That's literally... Oh, so be it. Um, two divisions, huh? I'll send one motorized and one tank. Even though I probably should have already learned... From, actually, you know what? I should have learned from last time that... Oh, just switch, switch them out. Alexander. Uh, actually, Pavel. How about Pavel? There you go. What about these guys? Because they'll probably win. And I want to join whoever's going to win. So, why would you want to join a losing fight? Because you can sometimes. That's why. Oh, uh, we can send about 100 guys in. It's not bad. Where's our sh planarinos? There you are. Fighters. Drones. And like I said earlier, we do have some comms to get through. So, let's see. So, choose mobile warfare as a land auction. What? Well, I believe we already have. So, that's pretty good. Rapid military expansion. We're actually demobilizing now. Fine, whatever. I'm pretty sure we did choose... Yeah, we did choose. Actually, that's a delay doctrine over there. Oh, we have delay doctrine and, and oh wait, this this delay doctrine is actually better. You both get the tactic for a delay, but this one gives you five more organization. Nice. I didn't realize that. I should really realize things maybe a little bit more quickly. There you go. Please don't die in the desert like we did, <laughs> or in the mountains like we did in Libya. <laughs> oh man, those poor guys. Those poor poor guys. I was gonna say por qué, but whatever. Uh. Our motorized are not... Oh, now they're fighting. Good. Hopefully we can win. Yeah, I mean, what else are we going to do here? Like, I, I really don't know what we're going to do. There's not too many other conflicts that we can really, you know, get involved in. Ooh, the carrier. Look at that. And all these subbies, yeah. Pull the subbies out. Oh, if I remember correctly, we did want to make sure that these guys... Go ahead and train... It. Well, I want to upgrade you guys because... Yeah, you might as well just upgrade them because they're not very good. Oh, you're light cruisers. Oh, wait, what am I doing? There you go. You guys are subbies, too. It's fine. Actually, just join them. You might as well, finally. Cool. So, I want to upgrade all those guys. It shouldn't take an extreme amount of time, but let's do five, and then go to five. I want to keep that one pretty high. Go to high. Uh, heavy hole is fine. Subs, do like that. So, let's start, like, refitting these subs. At least it'll be better and actually usable. Go camp here, sus. It's kind of nice. Um, seriously, what else am I going to do down here? Uh, let's go with... Eh, I'll go with combined arms. Why not? Currently get 1.6 every single day. Solidify our group over Europe. End of Turkey. Kind of like that. Settle with China. Destroy the Chinese traders. I think that sounds like a lot of fun. Japanese Revolution. I want to help our economy out first. I'm not sure if anything else will happen. Caspian oil is not bad. But the workforce, why not? The Soviet workforce should be diverted to agriculture and other areas of society, perhaps even the military. Better artillery, very good. Let's see. That's 2012 still. Recon would be nice maintenance companies. We need those on our tanks. Another division. Ludmilla? Ludmilla? Brusilov? Yes, please. Oh. Oh, wow, these guys are almost dead. Beautiful. Just gonna hang out. Solidify our grip over here. Nice. Divert the workforce. That helps us with more consumer goods, and more stability, and slightly, slightly, slightly more population to use, which would be awesome, awesome, awesome. Oh, we have a very mobile uh, army here. Very, very mobile. We could help out, but... Mm -hmm. Actually, we got some more of this. Let's grab some material designer. Kalashnikov. I've got to go with Kalashnikov. I, l I love Kalashnikovs. Elastic defense. Always good to grab. Always, always good. Super heavy battleships. Don't mind if we do. Next up, well... We could do some air doctrine, land doctrine, industry. How about we grab some modern heavy equipment? Seems pretty useful, right? Updated next. Ooh, carrier twos. Yeah, that's still updated. Well, we got these guys. Might as well upgrade them too, right? Even though we might not even use these guys in our campaign because these guys are very slow and cost so much to build. And only two cannons there. Just tons of anti-air. If you want, we can get one of these too. That's fine. So much anti-air. Get some of this because I love that stuff too. And we're already 20. We're extremely slow. Wow. I don't want to make us any slower because this is as slow as we'll be possibly go. Yeah. N nothing lower than 20. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing lower than 20. So, aircraft catapults will give us even more sub detection and way more surface detection. And surface detection gives us the ability to detect surface vessels. So, not bad. Not great. That's going to be quite costly to build, but that's all right. You know what? Just start building that one. Once everything else is done, maybe... So many subs we gotta get rectified here. Holy cow. There you go. We should have enough for that, at least. Good, good, good. 
We can help support the attack right now. Sanders becomes president elect. If you'd like to read about President Sanders, go right ahead. The end of President Chomsky. So to do that, to get the American people's commonwealth, you have to, you have to play this to get Sanders. That's actually really cool. Really cool. So let's take another, talk about another comment. So even though there's a lot of support for keeping or going down the path to have Putin as Tsar, there's just more support for us to choose the path that we've already been on. Uh, I'm going to lose Ludmilla because she's a seducer. You never know what happens in the middle of the night. The 2012 Olympic Games, if you'd like to read about this, go right ahead. The time has come for games, games, games. Yes, 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 yes. And someone really, really... Oh, actually, quite a few people want me to play as the American Republic. Oh, don't get me wrong. Oh, God, Jeb is here. Oh, the Savior has arrived. But yeah, I will play as American Republic. Honestly, probably a few times, actually. Because you gotta go with Jeb at least once, right? It can happen here. Functioning, functioning government, huh? Corporatism... Duke expresses interest in corporatism, huh? Restore order. All right. Nationalist policies, conservative policies. Review the separation. Oh my goodness, a Christian nation. One nation under the chief. One flag under the one nation under the flag. Uh, yeah, definitely. I'll play the American Republic probably a few times. Mm, what else do we have down here? Anyone on the right? Glory, glory, hallelujah! Push for recognition. The president, the president knows best. Down with Duke. Oh, I got the triple K there. Absorb the Midwest. Sounds like fun. Yeah, nice. American hegemony. The American alliance. The American axis. Wow. Let's grab some radar. That'd be nice. Good. Good, good. Go ahead and train if we need to. Or we're missing any resources. Ooh, divert the workforce. Great. Ethiopia. Declare one Ethiopia. Well, good luck, Ethiopia. Follow it up with... What? End of Turkey. I do want to go to war, but I want to finish our stuff in Syria first. Let's focus on agriculture. Agriculture should be the lifeblood of a new Soviet economy. Very good. Divert the workforce. So we'll lose this. We'll lose consumer goods benefits, but whatever. Actually, we'll get more, actually. Even though we'll lose that recruitable population factor, more stability. If you like to read about this, go right ahead. House of Sullivan Restore. Seems like I should play as Ethiopia then someday. Wow, this is a mess. Led by Mr. Sunglasses. Do you have any focus tree? You do! Oh, Ethiopia's kind of wild. Empire, Empire. What about normal Ethiopia? Led by Demenka Menkonen. Oh, you have a generic focus tree, but we probably want to help support you as well. They have one division available, which we should probably be smart about how we do this. Um, we don't want to send just guys to their deaths like I did earlier. So, anyone have infantry? We do have some infantry. Do we have any mountaineers? That would actually probably be better. No. I don't want to send tanks or motorized in the mountains, so it's going to have to be infantry then. Hmm. We're going to need way more guns after I just did that. Yeah, we're already out of guns. Holy cow. If that's the case, field hospitals probably... Are, eh, let's just six. There you go. We're going to need way more... Oh, there goes that. Oh, boy. Uh, how are you guys doing? Well, I could probably send one of you guys over. Led by... Victor. No, no. Alexander. Alright, so how many planes can we send? Do, oh, maybe we can't send you planes. Another tank division. Good, good, good. I mean, we do want to take out the Turks, don't get me wrong. And can we come in through here? Yes. We could probably try to beat them up, blow them up, and then Egypt declare one socialist people. Oh, what the heck is going on? Alright then. Actually, how much skill do you have? He was learning more, so three... One, two, three, there we go. This is a really bad idea. I'm going to be losing so many tanks in this stupid war. Alright, so we can send about 100. It's not bad, not great. So I'll send you guys. You'll probably do okay. And then a few more drones, maybe? Maybe not. We have no more drones. Oh, god dang it. Yep, that's alright. Alright. Yep, and drones are tactical bombers. So, if you didn't know that. Ethiopia Division has arrived. Very good. Another motorized. I'm waiting for another army to pop out here so we can... Or more divisions to be popped out. So we can use them effectively. These guys probably are cut off from the capital, which is nice. These guys are cut off from the capital, which is not good. I'm going to have to keep you guys here so we can see what's going on. Good. We're on many different theaters. 
All right, let's go and do this one, Aircraft Designer. I always like getting the this one because you get more agility, which is the most important stat for fighters, so. Let's finish this war off. If we can't move, that's good. Let's see, yeah. Plays Commonwealth of America with Bernie Sanders, yeah, definitely. And he's been inaugurated. If you like to read about this, go right ahead. Bernard Sanders, oh, change of color. The APC, the American People's Commonwealth. You look really young in that photo. For 2012, that, is that, is that really how young you look? Hmm. Oh, they're fighting people already. Of the American Republic. War between the states. Okay. Now hold on. Oh, there they go, yeah. Are we missing anything else here? Just carrier twos, that's fine. Alright. And the soldiers have made it over here, and hopefully they don't lose. Um Field Marshal. Dimitri Bulgakov. Defensive. Panzer leader, finally. Alright. I'm going to say, stay in North Africa and have your time, your way with these people. Good luck. We're going to ruin supply up here. That's okay. Oh, God. The provision of Congress dissolved. Oh, boy. Can they pierce me? Nope. Alright, let's see what happens. And actually... Oh, my goodness. We have so many more things. Armored cars looking pretty good. Anti-air is looking pretty good, too. Light tanks, main battle tanks. We need so many more main ba battle tanks. It's not even funny. Um, guard tank brigades are not bad. I'd like to throw on tank recon, but we don't have that. I need maintenance and logistics for this. Hopefully, we'll get a lot more army XP, though. So, Can they pierce us, finally? No, they can't. Good, good, good. And you know what? With you guys, we're going to go stroll right up to there. You can help them out. Oh, kill them off. What's going on in Ethiopia, actually? Ah, before we do that, let's look at this. Yeah, the motorized? Good, we're done with that army. Loads and loads of motorized. You guys up out here, maybe? Yes, no, good luck. Uh, I'm gonna forget about you guys. Here we go. There you go, another cut off. Oh, our tank was actually defeated, but well, that's not cool. They should do okay, though. There you go, force of defense. We don't have that many battalions here, so it's actually easy to kill them off. Or, you know, it's pretty cheap to do force defense. There you go, three divisions, go bye bye. Now, the Egyptians are just flooding through. Holy crap, how many divisions does Egypt have? They have a lot of manpower. These guys have quite a bit, too. They have 32. These guys have 77. Oh, my goodness. I wonder if we could just truck on into Cairo. If you guys did this, could you just. Yeah, you probably could just kill them all. Very nice, very nice. That's what we like to do here. And you guys are struggling against these guys, which is totally fine with me. Maintenance companies. We have so many volunteers. Wowzers. Well, you guys are kind of stuck there for now. It's fine, whatever. You guys are doing a great job. Just crush them under your tanks. The Syrian Libyan. I don't know why I like Libya so much. I just want to help them out so much. So much. For some reason. I don't know why. You guys hold and go actually go that way, please. Thank you. You hold and don't do that. Thank you. Aw, oh, that sucks. Just keep doing what you're doing. Alexander, anything else? Nope. The Me 3. Oh, what is this? Focus on agriculture. New interest in agriculture. The Kremlin has announced a renewed interest in agriculture throughout the nation and how it can be utilized to resolve economic issues plaguing it. This renewed interest apparently comes in the form of subsidies, easing quotas, and developing new technologies for harvesting and growing. Great. Actually, we should probably get involved in the American Civil War. Probably. Alright, we can go to war with other people, which we might have to do later on. Settle with China. I mean, that's nice enough. We can make a deal with the Mao's Chinese. China betrayed the Soviet Union and communism decades ago, and now we shall finally get a revenge. Japanese Revolution, we will do that eventually. I think it's best to help our economy out, though. I would like to get this one, too, for a little bit more rubber. How much rubber are we lacking? Quite a bit. Steps towards growth. We remove agriculture and stagnating economy focuses. Wait, why would we want to get rid of that? Stagnating economy is really bad. Well, actually... Yeah, that's probably good to get rid of. Uh, uh, it's not that great, though. Civilian industry? Oh, this stuff is really not worth too much. But you do get a research lot of the yeah, military industry. Eastern military capabilities. We can always build more later on, so... Let's go a step towards growth. The Soviet economy is growing stronger by the day, and a future without stagnation is becoming ever closer. Oh, yes. Exactly what I wanted. Um, it's just a little bit ahead of time. I'm going to throw on... Recon? No... It's almost 2013-ish. Oh, let's grab this stuff, too. That's good. All right, so we got you guys. How much more support equipment? We want to do the cheaper one first. 50, 25 more support equipment versus 
Oh, that's not bad. We need more APCs if we want logistics, so let's go maintenance. Alright, so support companies. How are we looking? Not great. We'll go to three. We'll go to two more. We'll lower this by one. And throw on even more stuff. Apparently someone, I remember from the comments, someone said that even if you build more infrastructure, it doesn't help you build things any faster. So, good to know. And my goodness, I'm love. I'm loving using these guys. He's probably going to get so much experience. He's already level 4. Oh, level, skill 4 attack. Yes, please. Are these guys still trying to attack and win here? Holy crap. These guys die down there, which sucks, but whatever. And you guys are still trying to fight down here. Oh, my goodness. I mean, you can keep attacking until they all die. That's fine with me. I don't really care. That actually sounds pretty good to me. So it doesn't look like we can kill the Yugoslavians off. So maybe the better goal would be for us to kill off the Turks. That many tanks might be able to hold up, I really doubt it. So, you guys, uh, I don't know, just send everyone over here still, that's fine. There you go. Oh, is it just you guys? Oh, there we go. Uh, let's do this, let's do that, and let's do that. There you go. Cool. I know there was another comment from yesterday saying that we wants, he wants more of these clips. I mean, this is my channel, man. If you're watching this, like, I, I post so many videos. Like, sometimes three to four a day. So, it's insane how many I put out, how many videos I do. Doesn't mean they're any good, but they're not too bad. Now, let's consolidate the line a little bit better. So, yeah. Not bad. They're, they're still pushing in, but... I wonder if we could race to Cairo more quickly than what they could do to uh, Ethiopians. Go, 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 go. And we've lost a lot of tanks, so here's what we're going to do. That's good, that's good, that's getting better. Armor personnel carriers are good. Well, obviously they're not good, but... Tons of factories. Go, 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 go. How many people have been killed in this war so far? Oh, uh, the Northeastern American War? Well, I don't, I don't want to get involved. There's three fronts is already quite a bit already for me, so... 93,000, 111,000. Wow. Heavy modern equipment. Nice. It's almost 2013. Let's just grab some more... Uh, construction stuff. And by construction stuff, I mean output. I'm going straight for Cairo. This that should capitulate them, right? We're gonna get close at least, right? Get one more of this. Let's grab some some chief of the army. More yeah, let's go more offense. We're gonna be very very aggressive if we can. No helicopters. This isn't TNO, but oh, we've just been cut off perhaps. Benny Suif. Step towards growth. Some divisions have died there, so that's not too bad. How's the war over here looking? Yeah, it's looking pretty good for Bernie. Come on, get in there. If anything, I can go to war with someone else, maybe, so we can end this little conflict. Well, maybe just in case we'll do that. How long would it take for us to do this? Oh, we need way more political power and way more of that. Yeah, let's go to war with, like, Turkey or somebody, so we can call our soldiers back, just in case, because I don't want to lose these, this many divisions. That wouldn't be very cool. Go and retreat, guys. You're fine. You're fine. Come on, kill them off in Cairo. They're doing last stand, too, or something. Roll up, roll up. Like a fruit roll up. El Almin. God dang it, you pieces of garbage. Alexandria, just in case. Help him out, help him out. Step towards growth. Economy economy moves towards growth. Analysts of the nation, national economy have confirmed today that, they are definite, that, that we are definitely taking large steps towards growth, but we are still apparently have a long way to go until that point is reached. Until now, we must remain pleased that the first stage of our economic recovery has been completed. Very good. So we could do this stuff. I want to make sure we can go to war, so let's grab the war goal against the end of Turkey. While we are more cooperative than Iran, the Turkish government has proved to be less than gleeful about Soviet world order. Soviet. Keep these guys in place. Keep killing off as many of them as we possibly can. Oh, they've lost so oh yeah, they're, they're pretty much we're pretty much screwed here. They've lost so many divisions. We've cut off a lot of enemies though. That's pretty good. Come on, come on. 
Move in, move in. Um, we're getting quite a good amount of uh, XP as well, but still. Um, tank cards. We need those. Just put them on anyways. Okay, we broke over the river. Just please don't get encircled. Please, please, please. Alright, at this point, this is so dumb. Why can't Olivia do anything? Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go here, here, uh, no, hold out these two places. There you go. There you go. Guys, please, you gotta move. There you go. And we're gonna hold, because we don't have a port here, but that's alright. Let him come back in. There we go. That's so dumb. Just gonna hang out. How are you guys not done yet? This is so stupid of these guys. They killed off another infantry division, but I can't do anything about that. You guys are over here, and you're gonna be holding out until pretty much everyone kills you off. So, good luck with that. I'm glad we don't have to get involved in the American Civil War, so we don't have to get really too involved with that stuff. Good. Kinda hang out, have a good time. Uh, planes. Oh, now they're attacking us over here. That's not good. We should be able to hold out though, and we can we have we have each other to move into, so. And this is good for getting a lot more score anyways, or you know, strength or whatever. Um I mean they're slowly, slowly killing off all their enemies, which is nice. End of Turkey. What divisions do we have down here? Not that many. They might be able to break into us. Hopefully they attack us like crazy. Because I do not want to fight in the Turkish mountains. I would really, really, really suck. Holy cow. Uh actually no. Whoops, my bad. Cool. And having only three take divisions down here probably isn't smart. Are they guaranteed by anybody? No, they're not. Cool. We should do okay then. If we had to pull these guys down, so be it. And you guys are over there. That's, oh, there goes Olivia. Oh, that sucks. I mean, we did the best we could. But now they're going to have a lot of resistance. Do they have unique focus tree? Yeah, they do. That's interesting. Oh, I didn't know that. Hey, but we fought quite valiantly down there, so. Airburst weapons, not bad. And uh, we still have Ethiopia we can help defend and d hopefully do well with. And we still have Syrians, but never mind. Syrians won. Understood. Oh, this is a good time to go to war then. Alright, let's go ahead and come up here. Air combat, Ace Generation, Naval Factory Air Attack. And I got get artillery. I love artillery. So now we can focus a little bit more on making sure that we have enough equipment here. Especially APCs and infantry equipment. Oh my goodness. Got all that stuff out. We're doing really, really well right there. And after the end of Turkey, we're going to go ahead and go back to what? Ooh, we can do new embassies. Ooh, look at that. New embassies. Oh, yeah, why not? Investments? Fun Syrian rebels? Oh, this focus is not complete. Rio Summit. The greatest military? We get some army XP. Red Navy. Build the Red Air Force. Stay ahead. Ooh, armor gets more speed. I like that. Warsaw Pact. Land Doctrine. Armor. I like all this stuff. That seems kind of fun. At least it. Part of the trees opened up now. I want to go with some... Ooh, military civilian stuff. Hmm. Well, we can use military industry right now. For now, we should be focusing on military industry and how we can best support the Soviet Army. Or Navy. And Air Force, of course. We get a whole once military factory, but... You know, I'll take one more than nothing, I guess. And, you know, I'll leave it up to you guys. Should we go with this Eastern industry and eventually get down to a research lot that way? Or should we go with Eastern military capabilities... And go down and get a research lot that way. I'll leave it up to you guys to decide. So let me know in the comments below. Which one should we choose? And I guess it's time for the Turks to go bye-bye. Yeah, I guess we'll pop it then. We don't have to annex everybody, so. Good job, guys. Pavel. Well, I'll see you guys all here together. Alexander. Buying the mountains is a really, really bad idea. So. What if you naval invaded? Take out the ports if you can. How are we already 29 minutes into this video? It doesn't make sense to me. There you go. Let me try that. Good. And if you guys could, I know a lot of them are still trying to upgrade. 
and such right there. That's good. We got plenty of fuel. Not too worried about that. And we just popped out a second carrier. Wow, that's pretty good. Two carriers and nine light cruisers. Now these light cruisers probably aren't great. Yeah, they're not great. And this carrier is not terrible, not great. But this one is also not god awful. Alright, pretty good. Alright, put you under him for now, that's fine. Ooh, another sub, don't mind if we do. Alright, this is going to look very weak, but that's okay. Three, two, well, hold on. Are these guys ready to go? I guess so. Three, two, one. Let's get going. Everyone's joined in. These guys want to attack us like crazy. I probably should put some planes on first. Hold on. My bad. Plane-wise, do we have any other extra planes? Probably not. No, we definitely need some planes. My bad. Uh, put them on the tanks at least. And then put you guys... I don't know, over there, something like that. Uh, no, I'll actually put you guys over here. Since we're not using the motorized yet, anything else? Not really, no. Oh, they're actually attacking us? Oh, good. I'll start another Turks. Led by Akut Edibali. Okay, then. I think they're one of those people, so be it, whatever. Uh, sure. Yeah, I'll take some stuff, yeah. Thank you, allies, thank you. As long as we're holding and doing well, that's all I really care about, you know. Peace conference is over. Oh, there goes American... But wait, they were... Okay, they were annexed. I thought they were popular for some reason. Well, Bernard Sanders is here. Socialist Party. Nationwide conscription. Trade Council is arrested. The war effort. Wow. Minus one political power is pretty darn bad, I would say. This is doing pretty darn well, though, I'd say, as well. More artillery? Yes, please. Infantry training units, artillery brigades. I mean, I can convert one of these guys over, but actually, throw their artillery on. That makes you guys even tougher. Right? Improved automated management. Nice. Let's grab some of this. Some more cap is always nice, right? Improved construction tools. Let's grab some more... Maybe yeah, some more extraction, actually. Basic heavy equipment. Very good. And elastic defense is nice, but we'll have to continue going down with probably with mobile infantry, which is always usually a better one to do. Tanks already have a lot of breakthrough anyway, so... Oh! Hello! Italy! Wait, you're not in our faction? People of freedom! Huh. Okay, well, I mean... Italiv. Wow, what a name. Italiv. General elections, they leave the European Union. Um, Merchant Republic. Italian Republic. Hopefully go down this way. No, 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 no. Spread democracy, huh? Well, I guess, guess they didn't want to stay communist. I guess that's normal then. Well, you guys actually pushed through, huh? Wait, what are you doing up here? Oh, you're the other guy who showed up. That's right. There you go. How many men have we lost? 4,000 versus... Nikes. Bulgarians have done a pretty good job, too. Oh, that, that's okay. So you guys... Concentrate your bad selves over here. I think I got this group here. You might be able to do so. Let's see what happens. Have superiority, anybody? No? All right. Egypt is very violent. Leave you guys over there. You guys are doing well. Military industry. Very nice. And new embassies. It's time for us to establish new relationships around the world and strengthen the old connections. Pretty quick and simple. Uh, get some more of this. Get some more of this. Get a way more of this. And we gotta build some more refineries too. I mean, we oh look at that. We got more light tanks. That's nice. Grab some more of this. Grab way more drones. And main battle tanks. Yeah, do that too. There you go. Alright, let's get some more of this then. Fleet Logistics, Naval Range Factor. Um, close Air Support. Technically, we don't have Close Air Support, so all weather penalty. We'll do that one. If we were to attack, it probably wouldn't go very well now, would it? Fifty-six, it's probably going to drop down to fifty-five. That's what I kind of thought, yeah. What if we navally invaded? Could we be able to do that? Could we do that? You guys force the attack, you can kill them off. I know you guys can. Uh, yeah, we can, somewhat. Man, if we could race a guy down here, that'd be awesome. Race a guy over here as well. Well, actually, race over here. 
keep these guys in place. Take you and go and circle this piece of garbage. And he's the only piece of garbage because we're fighting him. And you guys go that way too. And help out. There you go. Nice. Just in case, go down there too. And you guys begin your assaults so they cannot move. Beautiful. Okay, they're dead. You guys go, 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 go. We have navally invaded and have done a great job so far. Keep one guy fighting over the mount through mountains, over a river, into this area. God dang it, we can't do anything there, that's fine. Come on, break down. Well, don't actually break down, but you know, do the best we can. You guys have got to do better than this. Come on. We gotta cut them off. We gotta cut them off. 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 Oh, done okay as here. Not great. Keep going. Keep going. More guys. Yelena? Hello, Yelena. If that's the case. I'm pulling off some motorized. We gotta get down here. The Greater American Union. Okay. Hold everyone in place. That's the most important thing that they could do right now. Let's grab some AK-15s, even though it's 2013. All right. You guys hold. You guys just kind of defend. And you guys hold as well. It's all about defense for right now. we got to get the motorized in here quickly. Get down there. Oh, that's a hole we have right there. That's not good. All right, so we've killed off 160, 70,000 of them. We're getting the motorized in here hopefully very, very quickly. Actually, retreat. Retreat that way. All right, the motorized are coming in. That's good. God dang it, stupid last stand thing. Come on, get in there. Come on. Eh, I probably need both infrastructure here too and here. Build up a lot of ports because we're going to use up a lot of supply. All right, motorized. Welcome to logistics. And tank tanks are looking okay. Engineers, they definitely, definitely, definitely need that. Don't want to put anything else on there for now that could help ru help ruin our guys. Anything over here? Not really. No. Spetsnaz. I mean, we're, oh wait, these are the guys we're already using. That's true. Anti tank, anti air can go down. Get logistics. That'd be better. There we go. That's fine. Just keep holding on. You guys are doing a good job, actually. We've lost quite a few guys. Actually, not nearly as many as they have, though. That's good. Becoming an organizer. Oh, we've actually linked up with these guys. Great. Which means you guys can do this. There you go, too. We've almost linked up with the main front. Good, good, good. Help them out, help them out. Beat them up, beat them up. Yeah, those motorized divisions are going to die, 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 die. Now, all they have are motorized. Wow. Stockpile. Support equipment, a lot of artillery. They're out of APCs, which is good. I mean, obviously we're out too. We've been out for, of APCs for quite a while. But that's alright. No new ships. That's right. We've almost gone up here. Ethiopia and famine ends. A tragic crisis. Oh, well. What's done is done. Great! We've encircled these guys, too. And they've been overran. Awesome, awesome. Supplies looking pretty bad, though. Oh, the Italians are... Hey, the Italians are invading. Great! Mm hmm... Now, actually, I'll put some logistics companies on these guys, too. Oh, we already did. Nice. Resistance. New embassies are very good. Fun Syrian rebels. South American summit. Well, let's go ahead and do... Manipulate Swedish banks. Why not? Sweden's economy has become similar to Switzerland, which is based around the wealthy and banking conglomerates. If we manipulate Sweden's banks and create an undesirable situation, all heck will break loose. Very good. How many men have we lost? 28,000 versus a third of a million? Not bad. I do say so myself. I still have plenty of manpower, but equipment-wise, they're, they're already out, pretty much. So. You guys, you'll do the best you can. You guys, over here, go ahead. Oh, they, they left the lines. What the heck? All right, then. If they abandon the lines, it's time to move in. Hmm. All right, well, whatever. Another general. Cool. What are we missing here? APCs? I want to use Recon Brigades probably for this. Recon. Uh, 
Mountain Ridge. Armored cars, even though this does not look like armored cars. They honestly be looking a little glitched for this, but that's alright. Armored cars, and then some more armored cars, thank you. Uh, let's see, armor, yeah, there should be all armored cars. Yep, they're all armored cars. Reconnaissance, good, good, good. We got plenty enough, hopefully. Yes, 700 is still left. We need way more support equipment, though. And they abandoned the lines completely. Like, what the heck? I've lost 30,000 versus 400,000 Turks. Jesus Christ. I love it. And the Italians showed up here, but they we're just puppeting them, so not, not too much is going to go. Not really going to happen, so. Keep these guys busy so they can't move. Naval stuff, decisive battle, anti sub, decisive battle. Look how happy our leaders are. Don't you wish you had leaders that are happy like this? That's what communism does to you, it just gives you happiness. Oh, yeah. Even more equipment. Yeah, we'll take that. Yeah, gladly. Istanbul? Well, that's got to be ours soon, too. You guys have done a great job. Um, in the meantime, I guess we can go to put you guys around Iran. I'm totally cool with that. Anything else? Not really. So I've still got to get work done, but that's all right. These guys are all going to die. I love it. And they're attacking us, too. Ah, makes you feel so good on the inside, doesn't it? Cool, six divisions gonna go bye bye. Head on up. Go straight to Istanbul. Oh, did we see something? Yes, we did. A convoy, good. 500,000 have been lost. Now we all need the capital, which is going to take quite, probably quite a while to take out, which sucks, but whatever. Awesome. We're looking really good. I think we've done a really good job. Better th than I thought what we could do. Hey, everyone, Istanbul. Let me guess we're missing armored cars, probably. Yes, we are. I kind of figured that would happen. Whatever. Alright, everyone, let's head on in. Have a good time. Do the best we can. Any other upgrades? Yes, we do. Sergei Shiogu. Ah, offensive, dude. Democratic Institution Italy. Well, that sucks. Democracy? No thanks, man. That's that's kind of cringe, man. Kind of cringe. In the meantime, you guys can head on back. I think we'll be okay. In our focus tree, can we do anything about Yugoslavia? Yugoslav. No. What? What? No, we got a man who's going to war with them then. I'm not going to have Yugoslavia be independent in my Europe. Either join our faction or die. Alright, you want to hold then, that's fine. How many more dead Turks do you want, Turkey? Eh, that, well, I mean, we, there's so many dead, holy cow. Even though we're not winning here, that's okay. That's okay. And manipulate the Swedish banks, that'd be nice. New Delhi coup, we could do that eventually. Um, let's do the greatest military. The Soviet Union possesses the most outstanding army on the planet, being its sole superpower. You betcha. Oh, Chet, you betcha. Advanced industrial technology, very good. 2013 silk. So let's grab some more extraction, because that's good. Resource wise, we're not doing too bad down here, actually. You guys are the normal tanks, or motorized from that group, that's fine. In any case, actually, I'm going to have you all hold. I'm going to hold for here for now. Stop fighting the battle. You guys do this. Yes, there we go. Very good, very good, very good. And grab some more artillery. Good, good, good. Uh, oh, Naxalite Uprising. Who are you? Oh, communists. We like you. Led by a smiling dude. India, National Conservatives. What a bunch of BS that is, obviously. <laughs> Very nice. The German Indian War? I don't know why it's the German Indian War, but okay. Yeah, they're attacking us like crazy. They're attacking us quite crazily. Well, the battle for Istanbul will t certainly take a while, but hopefully we can help out this Indian faction down here. That'd be uh, pretty good if we could help them out. If in, in any case, I suppose that probably we would be able to push through maybe Pakistan? But of course, we got to kill off Yugoslavia first, but we'll see what happens. We'll have to see what happens. Yeah, I don't know why the Turks want to keep attacking, though. Like, it doesn't make any sense for them to attack. 
I mean, don't get me wrong, I love it. I love it when they're just wasting their own men, their own lives, and yeah, they might hurt our tank divisions over here quite a bit, but I'm okay with that. Let's see, we need way more armored cars, APCs. Uh, armored cars would be good. Maybe we have enough of this, go down to five for now. Get down to ten, Belgium joined us good. We need way more of this stuff, way, 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 way more. Alright, so they they attacked pretty crazily. What if we attack over here? Can we do that and do okay, maybe? Maybe not? Keep these guys in place, that'd be kind of nice. I mean, we killed off almost 800,000 Turks. Now, let's go ahead and make that 800,000? Come on, come on. Yep, we did. Good! Any other planes around here? Oh, oh look at that! Another carrier! God, we make carriers so fast. So fast. Such speedy carriers. Seriously, why are we making so many carriers compared to the light cruisers? Well, level 5, of course, light cruisers. Yeah, let's go down to 3 and go down to 2 for now. We want to get these rest of these subs done, too, so that'd be good. Any more guys? Yes, please. You guys head on down there. It'll be very, very good. You guys go ahead and train. we can get more army XP that way. And we still don't have enough command power. My gosh, point one a day hurts. That hurts so much. Hop out if you can. Yeah, they've definitely hurt themselves quite a bit. Wow. Alright, let's grab... Still 2013. It's almost 2014. Let's grab some of this. Alright, so maybe we should stop attacking on this side. And you guys stop attacking on this side. That'd be fine. Actually, give me half you guys. Split up and go there. There you go. And then we can attack from that side. That'd be okay. Let them attack and actually making this weaker might... For yep, they took the bait. That is good. Next up, we shall go ahead and grab air combat training. Yeah, probably air combat training for more ace generation chance. I don't use this one too often, but it's sometimes pretty good to do. Sometimes very, very good. Alright, very nice. After the greatest military, let's go ahead and do Red Army. Let's do it, Red Army. The Red Army needs improvements. <laughs> well, okay, that's a pretty uh, concise thing. Oh, it's capitulated. No, 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 no. Uh, let's see. Be with the Indonesians. Well, we're still at war with them, so. Happy 2014, everyone. Hope you're having a great year. And where are we going to get this focus done? What the heck? Oh, my goodness. It takes so long to get done. Oh, you can do that after 2013, huh? Finally. Thank goodness. Oh, my goodness. Alright, so more divisions. That'd be nice. I'll throw you guys. Maybe on this side, perhaps. That'd be pretty good, right? Should be able to go to war with Yugoslavia relatively soonish, right? Hopefully. Alright, so where are all the soldiers? Are you... Why are you taking so long? Ah, uh, you have to go through the mountains. That sucks. Uh, it doesn't matter for too much about time right now. It's 2014. Grab some more research speed or modern hardware. There's not even a description for modern hardware. So be it. Whatever. You guys head over here. And then you guys head on over here. And actually, let's do this as well. Okay, I don't understand. Sometimes it, sometimes it works. Sometimes it does not work at all. Sometimes you can put them on, sometimes you can't. Screw it, just do that. And then you guys... There you go. Make it a little easier on us, how about that? More military factories, please. Ooh, Coast Guards, we don't need those. Or those naval bases, actually, anymore. There you go. That'd be good. 320 factories, never enough. Uh, these guys have shown up, which is good. Oh, oh, they're going to Arizona, 2014 Olymp Winter Olympics, cool, the time has come. What are we doing wrong here? Making some outdated artillery, maybe get some better infantry, equipment, ah, there we go, look at that, beautiful. Exactly what we wanted. Good, good, good. And we should be able to go to war with Yugoslavia soon enough, too, and I just want to pop at them, so. Just like what we want to do the Turks here, even though they've lost over a million Almost a million. India, India, India. Actually, are they fighting anyone else now? No, but we'll make sure that they will fight a lot of other people. Good, and they're about to all die. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh. Goodbye, enemies. Goodbye. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Ger I love Germany. They, they can send you so much stuff. We've lost 40,000. They've lost over a million. So good. Alright. Enough time for negotiations. 
go ahead and take put him out of the misery. You know, some upgrades. Finally, we have enough here. Logistics. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. It's better than offensive wizard or offensive doctrine just because less supply usage. Oh. Oh, look at that. Wow. We were lacking quite a few guys, weren't we? Or, uh, amount of fuel. Wow, that's really bad. Armored cars. We'll get our armored cars doing well enough later on. It's fine. Not really worried about this. Since we are going to pop with them anyway, so. Not too worried. But hey, having the Turks and us with us will be a great boon to our uh, economy. Can't quite sphere them like in Vic Victoria, too, but that's alright. After the Red Army, let's go ahead and do cheaper production for more armor max speed or stay ahead. As much as we want to do that one, cheaper production seems pretty good so we get more speed. Who needs more advanced weaponry if you have double the weapons? Which, I'm not sure why we get more max speed if we get double the weapons or something, but okay, whatever. Whatever, you know, whatever. And there goes Arizona. I really didn't tab over because, I mean, I figured Arizona, as we saw in the last episode, was literally all by itself. There's nothing really special about it. I mean, if they, if Bernie Sanders can take out the American South, then Arizona has no chance. Just saying. If you're from Arizona, my apologies, but it is what it is. Or uh, maybe not Bernie Sanders, but the Union of American People's Republics. Actually, eventually, can these guys kill each other off? That'd be really cool. Can they peacefully unify together? Uh, socialists? Uh, I guess technically socialists don't always like communists. But, yeah, maybe. Well, hold on. What type of flag is that? Oh, do you have, oh, you do have a lot of resistance. What the? Bad word flag. Oh, you changed your... Uh, now you look more like normal Bernie Sanders. Not the youngest self. Come on, guys. We've almost got it. And then it's Yugoslavian time. <sighs> Three carriers is awesome. Hey! Thank you. Finally, that took forever to do. Thank you, everyone. Now... I did say I just want to pop with them. I don't really care about owning Istanbul. Well, whenever we play as Russia or the Soviet Union, and we we normally take that area, but whatever. Yeah, we don't have claims on it, so good. You better give me what you got. We're still fighting India. It's going to be a pain in the butt. Whatever. It's all right. You guys are over there prepared for war. Go ahead and train yourselves. You guys, go ahead and convert. That's fine. Train you all... Nice. And I grab some more rubber because we can. So really, I need to pull out you two. Because you guys are really the tank divisions here, so. Dimitri Bulgakov. We're going to strike south into this area of Serbia first. And we will puppet them. And I promise you that. We will puppet them. We already don't have a lot of war support, but whatever. Cheap production. Oh, let's keep doing this stuff. Why not? How are we doing on anything else? See, we're good on armored cars again. Love it. Artillery needs some more upgrades. Anti-air. At this point, airborne brigades are cool. We don't really need them. We don't really need that. Oh, mobile infantry. Let's grab some uh, mass motorization. That'd be awesome. Let's upgrade these guys. Six and four. I guess these main battle tanks are just heavy tanks, so. I would hate to see what modern tanks look like then. Cancel on these. We don't need the, these guys on there. Anti-air might not be bad. Military police would not be bad either. I, I, I'm going to wait, though. I think it's best to wait for that one. Spetsnaz. We could make these guys 40 combat width, but we already don't have enough APCs as is, so... We're still minus 2200. It's best to wait on that. Follow it up with the last one, Fleet Logistics. I guess 5% range isn't very much. Attrition probably is a greater effect on what we want to do. And we'll do Infantry Weapons Program or New Delhi Coup. Like that. It would be extremely risky and have, have international ramifications. But a loyal government in India is necessary for a future worldwide. Or future world order. Yeah, why not? Are you guys almost done training? What's going on? Ah, oh, just a few of these guys are left. Government staff for school is good. Ethiopia's oh Ethiopia's gone huh? Oh there goes Ethiopia now. The time for the Empire of Ethiopia. Oh ships. Did we actually get everything done here? Nice. Not bad if I do say so myself. We need some more cruisers though, of course. Cheap production, smart bullets, New Delhi Kuvin. 2014, let's grab some of this. That'd be good. Uh, you guys. Okay, 
Union of American People Republics of Claiborne, Utah. Well, good luck with that. Uh, stop doing that. And then you guys actually come down here and there and there and there. Good. Take you and actually, I'm going to split you in half. Take you and split you in half. Awesome, awesome. Take you and split you in half. Hopefully this just divides them up okay. That is pretty much what I expected. Or at least we're developing a navy. It shouldn't be that much longer, right? Ah, oh, it's less than 10 days, pretty much, at this point. Good, good, good. New Delhi coup. We're doing really well on pretty much everything but tanks, of course, and APCs. Totally fine with me. Just need more military factories, that's all. And maybe another synthetic refinery. How about that? There we go. Eventually, we will build up all the infrastructure. I'll do that probably off-screen. Make it a little easier for us. Are we still demobilizing? No, we're only on volunteer only. It gives us, what, 0.5? 0.1, 0.5, and this doing anything more hurts our output levels. Wow. All right, interesting. I did not realize that. That's all right though. Okay, stop training. Uh, actually, you guys can train too if you want to. It's fine. A little bit of lag. That's okay. Raider interception group, passive defense. Oh wait, what? They, wait, what? They, what? They already capitulated once, didn't they? People knew this was going to happen. They must have known. All right, Yugoslavia. League of Communist Revolutionary Socialists. Huh. Good amount of manpower. We lost 64 guys versus 5,000 Yugoslavians. Obviously not enough. Any uh, upgrades? Oh! Oh, actually, that's not good. We lost some subs. How do we lose subs against... Oh, maybe they're destroyers. Sink them, convoys. That's good. Good, good. Do you have any upgrades? Alexander Nosatov? Consumer expert? Yes. Oh, wait, no. That's This is for... Uh, that's alright. We can still use them. We can still use them. Oh, there goes Utah. Goodbye, Utah. Sergey. Probably want <sighs> Silent Hunter computer reveal chance is not bad. We can't do anything about that though, anyway. So we've lost three thousand versus seventy-five thousand. Not bad. We could go to closed economy, but mm, we're kind of okay right now. All we really need is just more rubber. More convoys go bye bye. Many more convoys go bye bye. Divisions go bye bye too. And actually, since we're done with that, go to war with. Is Iran in here maybe? Iran? Oh, yeah, side with Iran? No, but we Oh, uh, yeah, maybe. But that's friendship stuff. And to do this, we need to march on Moscow, which we can't do. So we're limited with this stuff, so basically we've got to do it manually. So, Persia. No. Alright, so we got to go to war with Iran manually. Which I might just like annex their lands. 145 days is way better than 290 for these guys, so. Yugoslavia. Come on, give it up. You're not gonna win here, Yugoslavia. We've only lost 12,000 versus your 160, 70,000. Jesus. Modern hardware, let's grab some better uh, radar. Love that radar. Now we got plenty of army XP, I'll say that. Oof. So good. I uh, can't do anything there. Call an election. Nah, passive defense is good. Even more passive defense then. Oh, sink them. Sink them, sink them, sink them. No, it's looking good. Looking pretty good. Split. Just go all along the coast if you can. That's fine with me. Plenty of fuel still. These guys are. Well, they're gonna die. And. They're dead. Oh, well, it's 200 units there. That's fine. Alrighty then. 200,000 dead? Over 300,000 dead. So since we got it, we can go do that. That's fine. Let's do China next, because China's going to be a little bit of a problem, probably. I mean, Yugoslavia, and their ignorance, I mean, they chose this. They didn't want to do anything about it. 92 divisions, 54,000 manpower left. They're just being sent to the slaughterhouse, so... Fine with me though. Hopefully it's fine with you guys as well because uh, it's not too bad for us. 
I mean, yeah, it's not great, but still. Union of Lincoln, huh? New Delhi coup, and then what's after that? Let's go ahead and grab some infantry weapons program. An infantry weapons program will do many great things for the advancement of the Red Army's capabilities. Uh, still got like four days left, so it's gonna take a while. Not bad, looking very, just so messy. We've lost 40,000 versus 400,000, so I'm not complaining about that at all. How could you complain about that? We're doing great. Uh, we have, I wish we had more command power, though. Wait, I'm pretty sure I clicked on China, didn't I? I'm, I know for a fact I clicked on China, so... Alright, let's see. We'll go to grab some fuel. Eh, we can, why not? And infantry weapons program. Good. Not that many bonuses, but hey, I'll take whatever we can grab. Hey, the Yugoslavians have capitulated. That's a long journey, but we're just going to straight up puppet these guys. Oh, we lost... One of these guys, a New Delhi coup fails. Uh, terribly unfortunate news has arrived from New Delhi. Our perfectly orchestrated and complex plan for a sudden coup has ultimately failed, with all ringleaders arrested and their current whereabouts unknown. The capital's calm, the Prime Minister is safe, Chairman Putin has been humiliated. What went wrong? Probably plenty of things actually went wrong. Union of Lincoln is gone, which is no surprise at all. And put you guys around China. Lots and lots of bodies around China. Passive defense, very good. Get some partisan stuff. Good, good, good. And are we just fighting on Iran now? Or was it Pakistan? It was Iran. Alright, well, we kind of like each other. But that's obviously going to have to change. And we're going to need way more infrastructure down here to do a good job. Cool. Not bad, I would say. Not bad. You guys do well with that. I'm not going to send my tanks over there just yet, because supply is going to be really, really bad, so I'll wait just a little bit. Let's get through one more focus before doing anything else. So who's leading Turkey now? Kemal Ukayan. Ukayan. Alright. Government knows best, you betcha. And does Turkey have claims? Yes, we might just take out these guys and give them Turkey. Led by Asya Abdullah. Man, you got a face. Yeah, she definitely got a face for that. Hmm. Alright. And even though these guys... What the heck has here? Gen... What? What? Why is Genoa free? Rafael... Rafael... Vito... What did you do? Profits from republics, huh? Not bad. Cool. Any partisan measures? Alright, the next research will be done in two days, and the next focus will be done soon, too. Alright, it's 2014 still. Let's grab some better fighters, perhaps. Yes, please, that'd be very good. And the next focus we shall end with, well, let's maybe focus a little bit more on our land doctrine. Well, since we're available anyways, we'll probably destroy the Chinese traitors. China betrayed the Soviet Union and communism decades ago, and now we shall finally get our revenge. Hopefully we can do that, just because I'm pretty sure China's got a god-awful amount of population glory to the state and then they also have what loyal military more attack and organization not bad that's a lot of bodies not gonna lie that's a lot of divisions too so we should wait to go to war with them then that's a lot of bodies that's a lot of dudes uh, we, we want to go to war with these guys anyways first right right oh we have you guys too um Very good, very good. Uh, both of you guys go on to go right there. Nice. Can I actually just duplicate you? That'd be kind of nice. Oh, the Midwest Union. Very good. Any more fighters? I mean, I'll, I'll gladly take the fighters. Fighters are always nice. Construction stuff takes... Oh, yeah, we need way more military factories. Stay on five, then. And let's end the episode with... Destroy the Chinese traders. Well, hope you enjoyed today's episode, guys. If you did, please consider, really, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow when we hopefully go to war with China. And maybe take out the PRC as well as India. Thanks for watching. Have a great, great rest of your day.